Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program has to accept the integers R, C, and the matrix and K as the input. And then we have to rotate the four quadrants of the matrix for K times in clockwise direction. And finally, we must print the revised matrix as the output. We have also given a note that R and C are always even. Now we'll take our first test case. So in this test case, we have four rows and four columns matrix and the K value is two. So let us divide this matrix into four quadrants. So they'll be divided like this and then the middle like this. So now we have four quadrants. So in the first quadrant we have 10, 20, 30 and 40. And in the second quadrant we have 11, 22, 33 and 44. And the next quadrant we have 55, 65, 77, 88. And in the next quadrant we have 50, 60, 70 and 80. So now they have given the k value as 2. So we have to rotate this quadrants for 2 times. So for the first rotation this quadrant will be at the first. That is 55, 65, 77 and 88. And for the next quadrant, we will have 10, 20, 30 and 40. And for the next quadrant, we will have 50, 60, 70 and 80. And for the last one, we will have 11, 22, 33 and 44. So now one rotation has been done. And now for the second rotation. First we will have 56 and sorry 50, 60, 70 and 80 as the first quadrant and then we'll have 55, 65, 77 and 88. And then we'll have 10, 10. So as the third quadrant we'll have 11, 22, 33 and 44. And finally, we will have 10, 20, 30 and 40. So this will be our output that is we have these four quadrants as a single matrix. Now let's see how to solve this program. So first we'll get the inputs R and C that this number of rows and columns and then we'll get the matrix as a list that is list of map of in comma input of dot split of and it will be for row in range r comma sorry only r so we'll get the input of the matrix like this and then we'll get the integer k 
as the input and now we'll be iterating from CTR 0 to CTR K and in that iteration we'll again iterate from row 0 to row R double slash 2 and after that so in this iteration we will have the matrix of row and c double slash 2 which will represent the half that is only this one and we'll have the matrix of row the other half that is c double slash 2 colon so this will represent these elements and now after this we'll have the matrix of row double slash 2 plus row and in the for the column we'll have c double slash 2 so this will represent the third quadrant sorry the fourth quadrant that is this one and for the last quadrant we'll have the matrix of r double slash 2 plus row and in the column we'll have the other half that is column c double slash 2 so after this we'll have the matrix of r double slash 2 plus row and column double slash c double slash 2 and then the matrix row colon that is colon c double slash 2 and then the matrix of row c double slash 2 colon so as you know they are in rotation they will be coming again and again so matrix of r double slash 2 plus row and then c double slash 2 colon and after this we'll just print the matrix and that will be our output Thank you.